Hey you guys, it's your boy Sid again, and guess what came in today? What I was talking about in the last video, which is the stock pot. So, remember I told you guys that that's so much I have planned for this video, uh, or for the series that I'm going to be doing, this YouTube series. One of the things that I like to do, i to straighten this camera up a little bit, so y'all can see some of these gains, and I'm just playing. But one of the things that I like to do is really just cook and just kind of eat really wholesome meals, like real food. Because like I'm trying to get bigger in the gym and it just real food just gives me energy and just I like to cook. So one of the things I like to keep on hand is um, chicken stock. And I'm going to do a video about how to make chicken stock. But I ordered a pot from Macy's and it came in. So I'm just going to open it up and show you guys the pot and everything like that. So let me open up the package. It came in a pretty large box. But yeah, Macy's had a pretty good deal. They had like free shipping if you spend over $50. This pot I actually got for a really good deal. It was like 36 bucks. And then I had a coupon $15 off if I spend $50 or more. So I purchased um, another package, which that's gonna come probably next week. Um, and I'll tell you what that is later to make it 50 and then I got 15 bucks off. So really I got two big purchases for like $35, $40 with tech. So it was a pretty good little sale they had. It was like a home sale. I used to be a big Macy's shopper back in the day. I used to work for Macy's too a long time ago, but Macy's has went downhill a lot. And so now it's like I don't really even buy clothes from there anymore. I kind of just buy like home stuff now, like stuff from my apartment. But they've got so much stuff in the box. All this paper and all the wrapping. It's kind of heavy. All right. Make sure everything's out the box. Okay. So, anybody who has bought any um, pots or anything from Macy's, you know they have their own brand called Tools of the Trade. And Tools of the Trade is like the Macy's brand for pots, but it's re they make really good pots. Um, they're all stainless steel. They're comparable to like Calphalon pots. They're really good. Um, they like absorb heat. So like if you're cooking something, you can cut it off and it'll still cook for like five or so minutes or 10 minutes. Um, it's really good. But nonetheless, this is a Tools of the Trade stainless steel eight quart four piece multi-pot i'll show you the box this is what it looks like tools of the trade see how i got the main pot with the lid and then two attachments those come in really handy if you're gonna make like pasta or if you're gonna make um you know stock like i said something where you have to put water or liquid in the pot and have the ingredients in another and you can just lift it out with the ingredients and then dump the remaining of whatever it is that you have. So let me just open this up. Yo, I've been so freaking like, I'm so exhausted. I feel like, I feel like just so overworked. Like, you guys know I said I'm transitioning my career and I quit my last job and I've been doing this job now for like two months, just temporarily. And I have to keep reminding myself it's temporary because for the last four years, I haven't worked until 9 p.m. I've been getting off work at 4.30 and then the last six months before I quit my job, I was working 7 to 3.30. So staying at work until 9 is just like really getting on my nerves. I feel like I'm like wasting my days and things like that, but... I'll hopefully get through it and then I've got two days off so I'm off tomorrow which is Wednesday and Thursday but then my aunt, I have two aunts that unfortunately passed away so it's like I'm gonna have to I want go to have to go to the funeral bus like I have to drive up there now and then drive back so it's like I finally get some time off and it's like I have to go I have to drive five hours to North Carolina and then you know go to the funeral events and stuff and drive back and then hop right back into it so but to go give my blessings and everything so i'm just tired you know just overworked sometimes i wish i could just not give a fuck like some people and just get a good 
paying job with a 401k and be content. <laughs> but that's not me at all. It will never be me. It's 958. Okay, so I'm opening the box. And again, thank you guys for watching those viewers that I have. I'm getting views on these shows, so the word's getting around. I guess I'm showing up in search engines, but for those who haven't started, you can follow me on Snapchat or Instagram, selfmade, s.e.e.s.e.l.f.made. Okay, so this is the pot, I'm taking it out. Oh, these are the um, attachment pieces. stuff in here to keep this sturdy I guess the pot okay so first I'll show you another pot so this is stainless steel normally I don't like pots like this because I feel like they could get discolored but the reviews I read were pretty good, so I trust that it's good. But um, this is the pot. You can see stainless steel. You can probably see the reflection. See the interior. You know, it's good. It's pretty deep. Nice double handles. In the bottom, you can see forgot what they call this but you can tell it's got that material where it absorbs the heat like I was telling you like if you're cooking something and you want to take it off the stove like you don't want to overcook something but you want to take it off the stove you can take it off the stove and like put it on the counter and it'll still cook for probably like five to ten minutes because it traps the heat and keeps it in there let's so got that this is the pot then I will show you this is the lid regular glass lid nothing special of course the lid goes on the top of the pot and this is a low to medium heat because it's a stock pot so Definitely something you would only probably cook like pasta and um, chicken stock and stuff like that. You're not going to really want to like do heavy cooking in a pot like that. Which is fine because I have several pots. This one is solely just going to be for probably boiling pasta and making chicken stock and stuff like that. <clears throat> I'm not going to be cooking like heavy ass big meals. <clears throat> then I have some attachments for it. So it looks like this is one that comes with it. It's like a basket. And I'm assuming with that, oh, that's kind of like a steamer almost. You could put water in the bottom. Yeah, I think you could use that one like a steamer. You could put a little water in the bottom or you could, yeah, you could put water in the bottom. Or think you could put like vinegar or like red wine or something. You could put vegetables at the top or fish or chicken. You can steam your food so you can eat healthier with this. Um, cook it that way. Or we've got the other attachment. This is the bigger attachment. Not attachment, but other piece you put this on the inside of the pot which it adds so much more room to it it like seals you can cover it And that, I think, is for where you're going to want to use to make your chicken stock and stuff like that, or vegetable stock. You throw all of the, you know, you use bones to make chicken stock, chicken bones, and maybe like small pieces of 
chicken for like broth, uh, your onion, whatever you throw that in there. And then when it's time to take it out and empty it, because all the liquid's in there, you just, it drains and then you have your stock and then now you gotta do a sift it again to get, you know, all the things out of it. So, let me see what all you can make with this. I don't want this video to be super long. That's Spanish. Yeah, so, pasta, steamer inserts, and yeah, that's pretty much it. So you got the main pot, the lid, the steamer, and then you have the attachment for like your broth and stuff like that, or your noodles. If you're making like fettuccine, like Alfredo or something, you got the noodles in there, and you can just quickly you know, you're boiling your noodles, you got the noodles on the inside, you can quickly just take it out, you know, dump the noodles and then dump the water that you don't need. So. But that is the video about my new delivery that I got from Macy's, my stock pot. Like I said, I have one other order coming that should be here probably next week. And then I have a piece of furniture coming from American Signature. Like I said, that should be coming on the 10th. So got some things coming in. I'll be doing more videos. And like I said, there will be more to come with these and probably better like edited films and things once I, of course, get better equipment and things like that. Until then, you guys have a great night. And again, you can check me out on Instagram or Snapchat, selfmade, s.e.l.f.made. You guys have a great night.